You have no power here. And it is only a matter of time before Soul's time is also mine. I already control the minds of its people. Soon they will finish building my temple, and I can return home. Send him back where he came from. He can await my arrival with the rest of Amriel. <laughs> as though you were not really here. Where? Where is he? This is a thing. Perhaps Storm can make... Come, there looks to be a way out through here. You see that green light? We must tell Storm what we have seen. The village is just ahead. Storm has used his magic to raise a barrier around it. I fear there is too much we do not yet know. Please, tell Storm what has happened. So you have seen things, yes. My magic grows weak, and so does the barrier around our village. Time is short. Tell me what you know. Really? How? The legends speak of that place. Terrible battles fought at the temple. The dragons burning it to the ground in rage. They speak also of something worse than dragons buried within. Difficult to imagine. But if true, it means what I feared has come to pass. Mirak was never truly gone, and now has returned. 
If you could go to this place and see him, are you like Mirak? Then perhaps you are connected with him. The old tales say that he too was Dragonborn. I am unsure. It may mean that you could save us, or it may mean that you could bring about our destruction. But our time here is running out. The few of us left free of control cannot protect ourselves for much longer. You must go to Sering's Watch. Learn there the word that Mirak learned long ago, and use that knowledge on the Windstorm. You may be able to break the hold on our people there, and free them from control. May darkness never touch you. If anyone can help us now, we should. By night, we reclaim.
dream? It's a nightmare, surely. If anyone can help us now, it is you. The air is... So it is. You have proven yourself an ally to the Skull, and so the Skull shall be allies to you. If you have released the Windstone and broken the hold on my people, perhaps you can do the same for the rest of Solstheim. I doubt it will fully stop whatever Mirak is doing, but it may slow his progress. I cannot help with that. None here can. You will need the knowledge Mirak himself learned. You will need to learn more about this black book. Mirak had this? This does not look like something of the dragon cult. It is a dark thing, unnatural. I would have nothing to do with it, but the dark elf wizard, Neloth. He came to us some time ago, asking about black books. I believe he knows a great deal about them. Perhaps too much. Seek him out to the south. Be cautious, Dragonborn. There is something else at work here. The power of the stone had been corrupted. It was the source of the influence that had taken control of the skull. Your shout broke whatever evil will controlled the stone, and restored its true nature as a conduit of the All-Maker's gifts. Freeing the other stones will diminish whatever dark influence is spreading across Solstheim. Yes. There are six sacred stones. Wind, water, earth, beast, sun, and tree. Through them, the oneness of the land is maintained. Freya saw that the tree stone now stands imprisoned in Mirak's new temple. I doubt that you can free it until his power is broken. But you may be able to cleanse the other stones. Even if this does not stop Mirak, it surely will delay his return. You are an outsider, and I don't know if I can make you understand. I will try. The Allmaker is the maker of all things, and it is from the Allmaker that life flows like a great river. As all rivers must return to the sea, so all life returns in time to the All-Maker. I know our ways must seem strange to you, but the Nine Gods of the Empire are equally strange to us. May darkness never touch you. <laughs> 